The black-hearted Tommaso Ciampa back where it all began in NXT. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa! Yeah, just ask Johnny Gargano how dangerous Tommaso Ciampa is. His former best friend, former tag team partner, and Ciampa willingly stabbed him in the back. Ciampa knows what it takes to succeed and reach the pinnacle. The years spent learning and excelling on the independent scene. Champa comes from a pedigree like none other. Absolutely disgusting display by this man when he turned on his best friend, Johnny Gargano. And for what? To become champion? To yes. act like this? Yes. To disgust the WWE Universe to the point where they boo you out of a building? Hey, it, it just it, comes it, with the territory. It's clear, Michael. Tommaso Ciampa has no conscience. This is going to be good. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds. John Cena is a man who's always practiced what he preached. He embodies never give up and hustle, loyalty, respect. Now even his detractors have to admit Cena's dedication. He never gives anything less than his very best. From where I'm sitting, he is the greatest WWE superstar in history. Cena is a superstar in every sense of the word. In fact, he was referred to by Mr. McMahon as the Babe Ruth of WWE. Now, seen as a guy who achieved success beyond anybody's wildest imagination. Say what you want about Tommaso Ciampa's approach to in-ring competition. He's a man of conviction. He truly believes that he and he alone should be the standard bearer of this entire industry. Nothing wrong with a little self-confidence. Ciampa's been at the top of his game for a long time. He just wants the respect and accolades that he deserves. Well, he's certainly not afraid to fight for those things with an unwavering focus. And across the way is one of the most formidable opponents in all of WWE, John Cena, a competitor who's been called Big Match John because of his innate ability to always rise to the occasion and deliver in the ring, especially when it's the biggest match of the night. I think you can argue that a John Cena match is always the biggest match of the night. and ready to work hard for the win. Yeah. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Powerbomb! He's not going to be able to pull this off, is he? Oh, is he? Yeah! Lift the powerbomb! Chip up, rushed up the hook.
taking some hits here, but this might just be what it takes to wake up. Big match, John. Great focus shown there from... Time to go to school. Figure four, cinched in. This could be it. Will this... Gotta find an escape. There it was. What a punch. Solid punch. Just save this match. German suplex. From the top. Are you kidding me? Will this be enough? Two. He narrowly avoids the count. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. Stops the kick. Oh, what a punch. The damage he's taking is starting to pile up. Slam. He thinks he has it. And he has the shoulder up before two. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Yeah. He got whipped into that corner. Boy, Byron, it's time for your favorite thing. I'm ready, Corey. Are you? Are you ready for the five knuckle shuffle? <laughs> and Big Match John has come out to cover. One, two, three. Good times he put him away. That's a pretty big win. Here is your winner. John Cena, he grabs the victory here tonight. Did you expect anything else? I don't know why Champa lost tonight, but I know it definitely wasn't karma. More like bad strategy.